Hello, my witty peeps and family. Of course, you all know who this is. Hey family, so Spirit put a quick little topic on my heart tonight to speak with you all about, and that's about getting graveyard dirt. And I know many of you get graveyard dirt, and you order graveyard dirt from people online and things like that, but I will tell you this, all right? One thing I want to caution you all about is that some of these spiritualists, you know, they will get you into a bind or get you basically fucked up in a lot of situations when it comes to dealing with spirits and the graveyard dirt and black magic and things like that because you want to make sure that you are getting your graveyard dirt at least from someone that you know and if it's not from someone that you know you at least want to get your graveyard dirt from a worker that you trust okay that you know that they will give you the right type of grave graveyard dirt especially if you're trying to do your own workings or if you're going to do your own workings, make sure when you go to the graveyard that you compensate the spirit that you're, you know, going to. You want to make sure that you give, you know, your offerings and, uh, you know, your gift or whatever. Like, you know, you want to make sure that you're taking care of the spirit and thanking that spirit for allowing you to use the graveyard dirt in taking care of your business or your client's business it's very important you know you don't just want to take and not give anything in return and it goes back to what i want to really talk about and that is a lot of times me and my my honey we like to travel down south a lot and visit and see people and you know visit family friends and all that we like to hang out we like to go down south and hang out and everything but i noticed like whenever we travel through tennessee and and mississippi and alabama and areas like that it's like i get taken back through like the civil war era even through North Carolina, South Carolina, you know, like when you're going through North Carolina, I, I believe this is how I go. You go through North Carolina, you get to South Carolina, you go through North Carolina, then you end up back to South Carolina, or as vice versa. But you all know uh, what I'm talking about if you if you travel down through that area and everything. But whenever I go down through that area, or we go down through that area, I always get taken back to the Civil War. I can, I can hear them fighting and everything like that. And I remember us going to a graveyard where um, it was a graveyard of soldiers and everything. I, I think it was like a mass grave. And um, I felt that I was granted the right to go ahead and take some of that dirt from that graveyard at the time. And when I did, I remember a lot of the workings that I did when I got that dirt, a lot of the things that I was wanting to happen manifested for me and friends of mine. So, you know, you definitely want to make sure who you're getting your graveyard dirt from. I wouldn't just get graveyard dirt offline and you don't know who that person is that's sending it to you or whatever or if you feel like you can trust them that's all up to you you know you have to go with your own intuition on things a lot of the spiritualists on youtube facebook 
Instagram, you know, social medias, they can tell you a lot of different things or whatever and tell you what to do. But at the end of the day, you have your own mind. You have your own mind to decide what you really want to do. You know, you can take information or people say about don't do this, do that, watch out for this, watch out for that. But at the same time, at the end of the day, you are an adult, so you have to do the right thing that your spirits guide you to do or what you think, you know. I'm not going to sit here and tell you uh, that you shouldn't go to this spiritual worker, you shouldn't do that and all that. I'm not going to do that. But all I have to say is that if you do feel that you've went to this person, you went to that person and things didn't work out, and if you feel drawn to me and led to me, you know, come to me and allow me to help you. You know, that's basically what I'm here for. And I don't like to put pressure on people anything, or anything like that, all right? So this is just a little video about, you know, graveyard dirt and everything like that. And, you know, just be cautious about the type of gra graveyard dirt that you get. You know, whose graveyard you're going into. Um, I know for a fact, um, you know, I, I know some people talk about in tranquil spirits and all that. I don't say in tranquil spirits. I don't know where that come from or whatever or whatever. But, you know, um, I do work with a lot of hot spirits. I call them hot spirits. Uh, you know, I call them dark spirits. And a lot of my family members, you, you know, they were that type of energy. So I know what I'm doing when I'm working with gangbangers, these spirits uh, that are like that, like that were in my family, you know. So I know what I'm doing when I'm working with that type of spirit. I know how to uh, give my offerings to my family, my ancestors, and I know how to... Uh, uh, release them or, you know, go ahead and uh, tell them to, they may go back to where they came from, you know, that type of thing. I know how to deal with uh, spirits like that. So, you know, if you need help, you know, feel free to contact me at highpriestesskathy at yahoo.com or highpriestesskathy at gmail.com. Please check the description box below if anything, so you can see about my services, descriptions of basically what I do and what I offer to the public. And also, um, you can feel free to shop in my store, candlesandmagicalsupplies.com. You know, um, my store is secure. It's PayPal verified. So, you know, my store is on the up and up. It has the SSL secure logo on there. Your funds are protected. Your money's protected when you shop in my store. So, you know, anybody that's hating on my store, whatever, uh, <laughs> they're just a hater and everything like that. PayPal is not going to hook up with someone uh, who isn't legit, okay, to run a business. So I have my business credentials and everything and all that, you know, in place. So, you know, I want you to feel comfortable and have happy shopping when you're shopping with me. If you have any questions at all, like I said, you know how to hit me up on my emails and all that. And um, like I said, take a look in my description box below. Um, you check out my kits, my money kit, my drunken love kit, my protection kit, my baneful magic kit. You know, I have a lot going on. And I thank you all for listening to this video. Okay, so just be cautious where you get your graveyard dirt from. And if you don't feel comfortable getting it on your own, then you really need to talk to someone or root worker in your area, or maybe even me, so someone can help you get the right graveyard dirt that you need. Because you don't want to get graveyard dirt from a murderer if you're trying to do love work, okay? If you're trying to do peaceful and protection work, you don't want to get graveyard dirt from a gangbanger, okay? So with that being said, I'll holler at you all later. Comment, like, and subscribe. Bye-bye.